What is going on guys, Bobby here, and today we got another amazing video. Now, I'm sorry I didn't post the last two days. I was taking a little bit of time off of Brawl, going, kind of like partying, um, enjoying myself, but we're back into the cycle. What we're going to be doing this season is actually pushing a little bit, so I don't have an exact goal. I think I want to finish somewhere from the 27k to maybe 30k range. Um, I started off at 16.7, we're currently at 17.4. So it's currently 221. We're up 700 trophies. We've had a really, really strong start. Um, I don't know how much we're going to push, but we're going to try our hardest and see how high up we can get. Uh, I'm not expecting anything huge since we started off so, so, so low. People literally started 6,000 trophies ahead of us. But we're going to try our best and see what happens. We're going to be grinding as much as we can. Anyways, all we're doing today is something very simple. We're just bringing out the Blue Crow, or as I like to call him, Crip Crow. And we're going to be getting into some Brawl Ball games. You, go, you guys just absolutely love Crow. You guys absolutely love Brawl Ball. So I thought, let's just pick up the Crow, start dominating. So let's head into some games. We're going to be playing with OG and Keith. Let's get into some games and let's see if we can go undefeated this video. Okay, so here we go into the first game and we're going to be facing a Primo, a Tara, and a, yeah, bleh, <laughs> a Penny. So what you want to be doing with a Crow is very simple. You kind of just want to chip away, keep them or try and get them low with your chipping, keep your distance and uh, kind of just chill. You know, you don't, you can't really do anything. You can't just walk up to someone and auto aim them to death unless they're super low like that Penny was. So, you know, it's a little bit hard to get kills, but you just want to take your time. You want to chip down. You want to be able to get your super and then jump on someone who's around like 3k HP or lower. So you guys can see that Tara is a little bit low. We're not going to go for it. We go for this Penny over here. We're able to pick up that kill on him. And again, we're just going to go back out. We're going to try and keep this Primo hit, not let him regen. OG is going to get that super off, which breaks the middle wall. And that's going to be the first goal for us. So you guys saw, we took our time. We didn't go into where we can die. No point of doing that. Just taking your time is definitely the strategy here. So we're going to hit that Tara. We're going to know exactly where she is now. Going to jump right onto the Tara. Be able to get that kill. And that's fine because I know my teammates should be able to pick up the kills here. Uh, if OG got the ball, I think we would have scored. But, you know, it doesn't really matter. OG has the ball here. He's going to throw that up. Tara does have super. So good play by OG just to give that Tara the ball. We're going to go and try and trap her. We're going to be able to successfully do so. Keith's going to go for the kills. I'm going to throw the ball into the middle. Jump on it and put that one in the net. And that is going to be the first game. So that game took... A minute 20 seconds you know crow definitely isn't ideal when grinding brawl ball he's definitely not the best brawler or even a middle brawler he's definitely on the lower end but you can definitely make it work so you're probably not going to see any super fast games since it's kind of slow pace you know getting your super chipping them down but let's see if we can go undefeated and let's see what happens okay so here we go into the next game we're going to be going up against a bull a rico and a shelly so obviously when jumping on our opponents we're definitely going to be looking to jump onto the rico um, obviously these shotgunners will just destroy us if we try and jump on them. So we're able to get one down. Okay, so two are down. Just Keith and this Rico over here. Keith probably will be able to get the goal. He's going to be able to do so. Put that one in the net. That's going to be a really quick goal. 18 seconds into the game. Okay, so let's just chip. Really good super over there by Keith. Chipping away, so we're able to get our super now. We're going to go ahead and jump on that... Uh, on that Rico, Keith's gonna get a couple kills. Pretty sure everyone on the on the map is dead besides me. So we're just gonna wait for everybody to spawn. We're gonna try and hit all three of them. There we go. Oh, no. He auto aimed the wrong person. Okay, really good pull over there by OG actually. He's gonna go down, but he got them super, super, super low. So again, we're just trying to chip, keep everybody low. We're doing a pretty good job of that so far. He's gonna jump right over here. Near the Rico, this Rico, oh my god, really good kill by him. If he didn't have the speed, that would have been a really easy kill for us. But with the speed, he just ran away. We didn't even hit him with our super, so really, really good play by that Rico over there. Okay, so we're going to chip away and get our super again. They're spinning, they probably got a goal. They did, again, another game. This one was a minute and 17, the other one a minute and 20. So you guys can see these games are taking a little bit more time. Let's hop into the next game, and let's see if we can go 3 now. Okay, so here we go into the next game. And okay, Poco, Primo, and Shelly. So we got we get outrange all of them. So we have that advantage. We can't really jump on any of them, but we do definitely have the advantage of range. We're gonna be able to kill that Primo over there. We're able to hit that Shelly as well. So the Shelly is gonna be pretty low. Let's go for a jump right onto the ball. We're gonna be able to pick up that kill. Gonna put it in the net. That's gonna be a 15 second goal. So that was a really, really, really good start over there. Exact same plan as last time. Don't want to get too close over there because then they're going to be able to hit us and that just takes away from the, from what we have, the benefit that we have of the range. Oh, that might be a triple pull. It is going to be a triple pull. Really good kill over there by OG. A little bit of BM throwing it off the walls. 
that is going to be a goal and that's a really quick third game so that one was only 40 seconds so that was definitely a good game definitely probably a fast run that we're gonna get we're able to get stars crow which is super super hard so let's hop into the fourth game and let's see if we can stay undefeated okay so we insta queued which is awesome you gotta love to see it you love to see the insta queues I'm gonna head right into this game so they have a colt uh let's see what else they have they have a shelly and it appears like a bull killed og so they have a bull as well this is gonna be a little bit hard to stop for us og oh he almost made the save he was so 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 close okay let's see move up over here don't really want to fall for the same trap as last time so we're just going to keep our distance and chip away. Going to be keeping this bull super low, which is definitely annoying him. You hate, like, facing a crow is one of the most annoying things in Brawl Stars. We're able to get a kill on that colt over there. We also jumped near the Shelly, which means we almost killed the Shelly. Where's the bull? Okay, so the bull auto-aimed that forward by accident, which gives OG some time to spawn. We should be able to get this save. No reason we're not able to. There we go. We got that kill. Good uh, IQ play over there by Keith, knowing where the Shelly is going to be. No way the Shelly's going to super us. Oh, supers Keith instead. That was a little bit of an odd choice. Going to jump up. Oh, no, we're getting the lag spikes. I think we got a really good hit on that jump. OG does have his super. He's probably just going to solo suck. Okay, good kill over there by OG. We just need to get a couple more kills over here. Keith's going to give them the ball. Really good super, though, by Keith. OG put that in. There we go. So there's a goal. The Shelly broke her own walls and wasted her super. So that's looking really good for us. Good goal. Uh, we're going to pick up this ball over here. Going to be chilling. We're going to throw it to that Shelly. Go for the jump on it. Risky play jumping on the Shelly. We're going to be able to get that kill over there. Got that one too. That's going to be a triple kill for the squad. That is a great win. That one was really, really good. That matchup was definitely super hard. We were able to get Star again. Made some really good jumps. And even though we did have that little bit of a lag spike, we're still able to get the win. So let's hop into our final game. Um, let's see if we can go 5-0 on the video. Let's hop into it and let's see what we can get. Okay, so we're going to do two more games. I didn't realize how short the gameplay was. We only had like four minutes of gameplay. A little bit more. So obviously that's not enough for a video. So we're going to do two more games. We're able to take out the Rosa over there. Oh, we're facing a Sandy and another Crow. Interesting. We should be able to pick up that kill. We are able to. That Crow is going to get a kill on Keith. Let's see if we can get a nice goal here. No, we're not going to be able to. We're going to go down, actually. Ooh, I tried to hit that Rosa just before we died. But unfortunately, we weren't able to do so. We should be able to make that save. Oh, the ball goes straight through Keith. The one tile glitch. And that is going to be a one to nothing lead for the opposing side. Okay, so this is getting a little bit interesting now. There's the Rosa. OG's probably going to go for that solo suck. He's going to be able to get it. Oh, we're going to pick up the ball, but we're not able to do anything with it. I don't think there's a way they get a goal here. Unless walls are broken. Oh, no, he's not spawned yet. Ooh, okay. That was way too close for comfort, but we're able to get the save. The Crow is going to go down. Really good super over there by Keith. So we're getting right back into it. OG with the solo suck. That should be able to kill the Rosa. How is the Rosa still alive? Oh, the Rosa killed... Okay. That was a little bit interesting over there. Let's see if we're able to hit that crow. Not able to hit the crow. The crow's going to go in and kill OG. I'm worried about this Rosa. The Rosa could be anywhere and just jump out at us. Okay, the Rosa's on Keith's side. We almost got the Sandy down. Sandy's a really tough matchup for a crow because you don't really have that much of a range advantage. I think we're just going to jump into the middle here. Okay, so we're definitely going to be able to pick up a couple kills. There's two right over there. OG's going to solo pull that Sandy. We're going to be able to pick up the kill. And OG should be able to get that one in the net. He is going to be able to. So that's a really, really, really good goal over there. 37 seconds left. It's super close. We're looking for our super over here. Just need to hit one more shot. They're just hiding. Their crow's going to jump in. He's not going to be able to do anything. We have the ball. We have an open net. Going to align this trick shot, take the shot, and that is going to be the game. So that was a really, really, really good game. We definitely fell back, um, and that was a super tough comp to beat with ours, but we're able to get that dub. So we're going to do one more game. Let's see if we can go 6 and all in the video. Let's hop into it. Okay, so here we go into the final game here. And we're going to be going up against another crow. Okay, so maybe we're making crow a little bit meta here. So it's probably not us. It's definitely not us, but... OP coincidence. We're going to be going up against a Crow, a Mortis, and a Frank. So we did a pretty good job with the damage outburst over there. Uh, we got them pretty low. 
So our teammates should be able to score. Let's see, OG going in. I think OG has the ball. I think he just scored. He did. Okay. One to nothing for us. Really, really good. 20 seconds into the game. We are close to our super as well. Okay, we can't go up too close since we've been hit. Okay, so this Mortis knows exactly where we are. I don't know what this Mortis' plans were, but it clearly did not work. We're going to super it to Keith. A little bit of a fancy super didn't really work out for us. We're probably going to go down here. We somehow escaped that, but that's a goal for them for sure. Oh, mm, Keith might have been able to stop that, but good shot by that crow. The way OG's shooting at Keith, I guess that means he definitely could have been able to save that. We're going to jump onto the Frank. Hopefully we have enough time to get that kill. We are going to be able to. Going to hit that crow. The crow it doesn't uh, doesn't be bad. Is it able to hit us? Oh, good super over there by Keith. The Mortis wasted its super. Okay, that's a kill over there. Frank's going to go for the super on us. We're going to go for the crow jump. We're able to get it. There we go. That was a really good goal. That is a fantastic way to end off the video. So that's going to be it. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Super, super fun always to play Crow. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Anyways, that's going to be it for today. Uh, we'll be back tomorrow with some videos. Uh, just one, obviously. But I am working currently on the Siege Guide. A lot of you guys requested that after the Brawl Ball Guide. You guys love that one. So we're going to be making a Siege Guide. It shouldn't be as long as Siege isn't as complex of a mode as Brawl Ball is. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed and be looking forward to that video. And it's going to be it. I will catch you guys later. Peace.